Hey guys, it's Helen here and today I have for you guys a small little mini Hot Topic haul. It's really Gurr themed because who doesn't love Gurr? If you guys have never seen Invader Zim, I highly recommend it for you guys because uh, well, then you'll understand what my obsession with Gurr is. But first, before we get into this Hot Topic exclusive Funko Pop, I did want to go ahead and introduce this adorable little plushy Gurr. He is so cute. He's actually ooh, he's not as big as he looks. <laughs> He is about hmm, the size of my, a little bit bigger than the size of my hand, which is not that big. He's got beans on the bottom, and he's got this little fabric faux zipper, and he's made of this like, I don't know if you can hear it, but like this material. I can't quite put my finger on it, but it kind of feels like smooth. He's got these huge bulging eyes and his little flappy tongue here. And his ears, of course, that stick up nice and cute. There's nothing in them, so I'm sure that at some point, if they're bent for too long, they'll stay bent. But they're hollow. But he's so stuffed and cute. Up here, he has no beans. He's just stuffing. These all beans down here in his body. He is absolutely adorable. It is so hard to find Invader Zim and Gurr things these days seeing as how they really don't show them on TV anymore, but he is absolutely adorable. And they actually make a smaller version of him. He's actually the larger out of the two, and he's super cute. And so if you guys are Gurr fans or Invader Zim fans and looking for like cute little plushies, I'd recommend going to your local Hot Topic and finding this guy. He was absolutely adorable. And the funny part is he's made by Gund. I did not even realize it until I'd received him in the mail. He does retail for $14.50, but as you guys know, Hot Topic always has sales, or you can just save him for your hot cash. But definitely check out your local Hot Topic to see if you guys can find this adorable little plush. So moving on, let's start with some Funko Pop unboxing. So here is the Hot Topic exclusive Gurr. He actually glows in the dark, allegedly. <laughs> I haven't taken him out of the box yet, but I've been waiting for this moment to take him out. Here's his little story if you guys want to pause and read it. If you've never seen this cartoon, you should really watch it. It's awesome. And I know Hot Topic has another version of him where he's like holding a cupcake, I think. And I think one that he's like half in dog costume and half like his regular robot form. But I haven't seen that one in a while, but definitely I think they still have these at the Hot Topic stores. So let's go ahead and open them up and take a closer look. That is shaped like a little cube. I've been waiting so long to finally take him out of the box and show you guys. He's actually very, very light. And he's like a dark, dark green. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna let him sit out for a while. And then when it gets darker or later, I'm gonna check in again and see if he really does glow in the dark. But look how cute he is. He is absolutely adorable. I assume the whole his entire body glows, considering he's all green. He's got his little tail back here. And the seam continues. So this is Gurr in his costume. <laughs> you guys have to see this show. It is amazing. And here's his little ears that are look like they're kind of glued on there. They're not like sculpted on. They're definitely glued on. And he twists very little, not too much. I don't want to break him. But yeah, so here is the Hot Topic exclusive Gurr. I think he's absolutely adorable. He doesn't come with a stand, nor does he have any holes in his feet. So he should stand pretty easy. And he does stand pretty easy. And he almost looks exactly like his little stuffed counterpart. Just this guy looks a little bit more wacky. <laughs> so anyway guys, if you are looking for some really cute 
liquor items, definitely check out your local Hot Topic. And I'm going to check in later and see if this guy really does glow in the dark. So I will see you guys in a few. Bye, guys.